Hello guys and welcome back to yet another episode of Maxime channel. We feature the craziest and latest from the world of traffic and this time around it's no different since we prepared another banger episode. But before we start today's episode, I'd like you to leave a like and hit that subscribe button as well. Without any further ado, let's jump right into this episode. It's really unbelievable to see how people can have a difficult time in admitting their mistakes. Such is the case with this driver as well. Bro, you almost hit me! You almost took me out! Bro, you almost killed me! Are you out of your goddamn mind? What? Don't run right by me, take that Oh get out, don't touch me bro. Don't touch me. Dude, we just got the bike, you nearly ran me off the fing road. Are you insane? You had no signal. I got it all on camera, bro. Don't even give me that. You almost killed me. What I want you apologize, you dumb You almost killed me. Are you insane? I got a family to get home to. No, I don't want to hear it from you. I got a family to get home to. You nearly knocked me off my goddamn bike. No signal, no and then you put your hands on me? Dude, Are you insane? You got my face in mask. You got all my ran him over, dog. Come on. You're a dumb yeah. dude. Yeah, it was an accident. And you're on your goddamn phone. It wasn't even on my phone, bro. We well, are doing some stupid dude, man. I was trying to turn and you were right. The human thing to do would be like, I'm so sorry, man. Oh, you saw me. I know you saw me. Yeah, I saw you after it was a dude. You're fucking I hope you're bro. be ready to be famous on the internet. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Let's go. Man. Almost killed me and all you do is argue. It, bro, hey. get in your car and go. I don't want to hear it from you. I'm not trying to argue. That was an accident. It happened, bro. I'm sorry. Is that what you want? I'm sorry, bro. But hey, right, let's go. Hey, I didn't see you, bro. And I, I thought you were way behind you, close to me. Hey, dude, whatever. All right, it's whatever. I'm alive. It doesn't matter. Right. Just please look out. There's a lot of us. I've lost friends because of people like this. Okay, that's why I get upset. Okay, I've buried way too many friends. Okay. Good. All right, Uh, I'm good. It's never a good idea to tailgate a biker. For one, they are not protected by a big chunk of metal like car and truck drivers. Second of all, it makes them really nervous. At the next traffic lights, the biker had enough and situation went from bad to worse in a matter of seconds. Watch. Drava and his wife got into a heated argument with the whole group of bikers. At one point, the lady tried to take out the biker's keys. This is never a good idea, and considering all the circumstances, the driver and his girl are lucky that the argument didn't turn out into something more serious. Bag 
te mașină o dată. Ai găsit unii dreptate, dar nu e problema ta. Ce ai mâncat? Dacă te mașină cu tutor, ții mă de pe tata. Dacă te mașină cu tutor, ții mă de pe tata. Dacă te mașină cu tutor, ții mă de pe tata. Dacă te mașină cu tutor, ții mă de pe tata. Dacă te mașină cu tutor, ții mă de pe tata. Biker was going over a speed limit, and one of the drivers was not happy at all. He made his frustration known to the biker by showing him the finger. At the next traffic fights, they started to argue, and this is how it all turned out. Deserves a middle finger. That's very cordial of you, very human of you. No, it really isn't. That's what's wrong with the world today. Did I bother you? No. But you had to. You had to tell me what you thought about me going over 20. That's nice. That's good boy. Good boy. <laughs> You're miserable, dude. You're miserable. <laughs> These bikers encountered an angry old Darren who wasn't happy about them riding on this public road. He said that there were animals out there, and out of all the things he could say, he chose to play that card. We're just we're just cruising around having fun, being idiots. There are animals out here. Yeah, I'm sorry. Are we? Are we? Uh, are you mad about that? No. Yeah. I, yeah. We know. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure you weren't like upset. Are you like not upset about it? You're not upset about it? No, I'm, I'm not happy about it. Okay, I understand. We won't do it again. Thank you. That's all I wanted to know. <laughs> ah, God, it's so muddy though. We're not even a This is like a road. These angry Karens were not happy because the biker was riding to the park. They took a picture of the biker as he passed by and he turned around to talk to them. Check it out. Are you guys upset that we're riding the dirt bike through there, or? What's that? Okay. All right. Well, sorry about that. Yeah, I get that. Okay. Well, everybody else seems to like it, but that's all right. You could have talked to me instead of taking a picture of me, but I appreciate it. This Mustang driver cut in front of the biker and didn't make him happy at all, that's for sure. The driver even flipped the biker off and when the biker pulled up to him to talk, things went down south pretty quick. It all started from the biker having a bad and a rough day at work. On his way back home, he was being tailgated by the police. They probably wanted to read his tags, but the biker turned around and made a rude hand gesture. They pulled him over immediately and this is what happened next. perfectly straight to the ground, parallel to the ground. Because, and the, re the reason being is because for us... You mean like bent down? down? Correct. Yeah, but perpendicular. Yep. Yeah, that works. Okay. Just it, like that. Cool. It's, it's hard to read when it's bent on the You're gonna write me a ticket or give me a warning or whatever? I got places to go, that's it. Gesture, the gesture. Is that why he pulled me over? I don't know. Maybe. 
Yeah. How you say it? Yes, here are you. So, let me, let me explain something. What's up? Here's, here's the problem. The pro there's a problem? Yes. So, you give me attitude. Give me the ticket, I got stuff to do. Okay. The ticket is over $1,000. Okay. Do you want me to give you the ticket? No, I, I would not like that. Perfect. Uh, oh, I, I expect somewhat respect, being that I'm not going to give you a thousand dollar ticket. I pull you over for a legal reason. I have a right to stop you. I get that. I've and never gotten pulled over for that. Time. It doesn't matter. Out of having a you like you sign a for a driver's license, correct? Yeah. That yeah. means I will follow every state statute for a vehicle on a public roadway. Okay. It's one. Okay. I understand. I'm sorry. I I didn't know. It's fixed. I, I'm not saying it's not fixed, but you tell me. Give me the ticket. I have places to be. If I was that guy, I'd be giving you an $1,100, $1,166 ticket right now because your tag wasn't on right. Uh, so, uh, I mean, I'm just trying to help you out, not give you a $1,000 ticket, and you just want to have an attitude with me for no reason. I get that. I get that. You know what's on my I get off at 5 a.m. Huh? I get off at 5 a.m. tomorrow. I have no sympathy for you just got off work. Okay. That's not, no I'm sympathy not whatsoever. Any sympathy that. I, I understand not. that, but you're using that as an excuse to be rude to me when I haven't done anything rude to you, man. I, I, I didn't think I was being rude. I just let you know that I have places to go. Yeah, like I, mean, I have, I don't have better things to do than pull you over. I mean, you can call me. Obviously, we all do. But instead of giving you a $1,000 ticket, I'm not giving you a $1,000 ticket. All I ask is that next time you get pulled over, you don't start the conversation out with, you gotta give me the ticket, give me the ticket. I got things to do. Does that make sense? Yeah, that That's all good. I ask. All right? Here's your license back. Right safe. Can you get blowy? Oh. Hey, you like that, wouldn't you, you I think you would. You want me on your knees? Yeah. Are they snobs? No, <laughs> he's a this biker got into a heated argument with That's a crazy a driver. He got almost yeah. hit and the blame game begins shortly after they caught up to each other. Both of them had their arguments and reasons for being in the right and this is how the whole situation turned out. Yeah. Come on. Bash him out. Get your bash out on. Uh, See which way he goes. I can go after him. Yeah, yeah. Oh which way? Quickly. It's not private property. It's yes, it not is. a private road. That was yeah, you on a double whatever, yellow line. Whatever. You tried one of my garden. Whatever. What? Attempted. Whatever. You, you were on whatever. private whatever. property. Whatever. Take Poton's number plate in I case do. he comes I back. Yeah, yeah. Face. Face. Get out my dad's face. Why are you dirty butter? You, you swore in front of my son. You swore first. You dirty bastard. And you swore in front of me. You're lucky if I didn't bust your face. Have you got a polo for him? He needs a polo or something. Luckily, in the end, it didn't get physical between them, but it most certainly was close. Make sure to write your opinions down in the comment section below. And with this clip, we reached the end of yet another episode on Maxi May channel. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this one as well. Make sure to write your opinion about this episode down in the comments, and if you'd like to see more of the same in the future. Your opinions matter, and we always try to improve for better. Once again, thanks for watching, and remember to ride safe and stay safe.